Scotch whiskey is a, it's a very wide, wonderful world. A lot of subtlety, a lot of interesting things going on in there. You have a wide variety of scotches, whether that they're blended, uh, you know, some of the newer blenders, as well as your single malts. And some things are a little softer, you know, some things are really peaty, and then things are really, really peaty, or they're gonna, you know, you know, lend themselves to a little bit more honey and heather. You'll get notes of, you know, sea air, flowers on the hillside. It's a very complex and wonderful liquor. Anything that is that refined tends to be a bit pricier. Uh, you're going to be hard pressed to find inexpensive scotch that you really want to drink. Unlike something like bourbon where you can get very drinkable liquor at a very low price point, scotch is going to cost you, but once you develop a taste for it, most people don't go back. I myself have turned into a scotch drinker as of late because I'm a generally insufferable human being, so if there's something else to be pretentious about, we'll find it. Some bigger notes of smoke come from uh, the traditional peat drying process because scotch is a malt whiskey, which means it's made primarily from barley. Once you germinate the seeds, once you soak them and malt the barley seeds, you need to dry them out. You want to do it quicker than not before rot sets in. Generally, you'll dry it over a fire. Scotland being, well, Scotland and heavily boggy, you get a lot of peat, uh, which they use as fuel. So we get peat moss, and they'll start a fire with that after it's been dried out and use that to, to dry out the barley, and you get very distinctive smoky notes. It's a really wide and rich style and an interesting tradition for scotch making. And when a lot of people think whiskey, they think Scots. They think Scotsmen, they think rainy moors on a Thursday afternoon. Scotch has a rich history of being, at one point, the most popular liquor in the world, because uh, where the British Empire went, it took scotch with it, uh, if you were wealthy enough to not drink rum. And that's a quick summary of Scotch whiskey.